Hey guys, how you doing? So here I am at the Agony Valley and the reason why is because I need to enter to this dungeon over here. It's a skunk or skunk, I don't really know how to pronounce his name. And I'm here because I want to show you guys how to get the boomerang spell. Now this is a really interesting spell and I'm going to explain you how to get it, what resources you will need to get it and why it should be a really really important spell to have so sit back relax and enjoy this video and so here you have the monsters you need to kill and the resources you need to obtain remember you will need 10 of each so good luck so there's nothing really special to explain about this dungeon but here in the fourth room is gonna be something complicated if you don't have enough summons because you will have this doll over here that will constantly heal the Sadida and it's invulnerable because it has a lot of resistances including to pushback damage so the only way you can actually kill it is by summoning a lot of summons it's gonna be like four or five I think because with every single summon he eats because he's gonna eat them he will get like two AP boost and he needs to get like a nine AP or something like that to be able to cast a spell that will kill himself so that's the only thing you really need to know and you can see what I'm explaining to you over here so as you can see here he already have enough AP to cast the spell that will heal himself so boom there you go also it's important to mention that he is going to hurt you a little it's just gonna be like 500 or 600 HP per character so be mindful because if you're too low you will die but that's it now you just need to kill us data all right, and so here we are at the last room of the dungeon. Now this one's gonna be a little bit complicated because it has the four Sadidas, the Buzz, and the Doll as well. I would say that the most complicated monster over here is gonna be the Doll. Because you need to take care about every single thing, including the Doll. Now, the Red Sadida will convert you into a totem or something like that so try to be far away from her because whenever you convert into a totem you will not be able to play because she will take 100 AP of you all right so that's not really cool also the doll that I talked about will keep healing the monsters over here so it's like try to kill them first and then you start killing the Sadidas or the boss itself so here you have the combat and if you want to skip it it's gonna be around nine minutes so feel free to do it but here you have it
all right and so just like that you can now talk to one of the cds in this case it's gonna be with the diamond one you will show her the boomerangs that are on the screen they are 10 in total and you will get this precious spell now this spell is really cool because it steals not just life but intelligence agility chance or strength depending on the element you hit with so you will have a 25 percent of possibility of hitting with one of the four elements right so it's really cool for multi-elemental builds for the other ones it's not so cool because it's like a little bit tricky you know you never know when you are hitting with your element so that's it i want to mention that it's a little bit complicated to get these boomerangs because the monsters are either high level and you might not be so high level or the prices are super elevated in total i spent like three hundred thousand camas because i could drop some of them but anyways it could be free if you just want to make it free and also here you have it the calyptus Duffus, which is my favorite Duffus in the game <laughs> well guys that was it for today's video and i will see you in the next one goodbye